Welcome to my garage videos again. So one thing I haven't done in the last couple of um, weeks or months is um, clean up my bike, like have it washed. So I've been riding my bike for so long now that um, it hasn't been washed. So today I'm gonna take a minute just to wash it out and um, so I can start it up before uh, I leave for my trip. So you guys are gonna have to watch me do that. So welcome back guys, here you see me blasting the rear wheel and the front wheel with soapy water, washing the, the front wheel, you know I have that cool brush that I use for it so I go ahead and then wipe the whole wheel down, blast it with some more soapy water and in the rear as well, here you see me cleaning it out, you know with that cool brush of mine, roll the wheels a little, blast it with some um, small soapy water you know just to get it really clean and nice you know and um, the underbody area as well there's usually gunk all over there so I like to wipe it all down you know um, pretty interesting stuff and then I blast it with just some cold water with my um, pressure washer I get try to get everything out as you've noticed this is fun to do as well cleaning my chains over here I have this cool well you see it in the link in the description right it's all really nice and clean right after this. So, I'm done washing the bike and um, pulled into the garage. So, I'm gonna use a little bit of chain wax on my chains because I washed it with water and soap. And um, I also have um, one of these to prevent rust as well. This is just a chain loop. When I'm done with this, clean it down and I'm gonna use the chain um, uh, loop to prevent it from rusting and moisture and things like that. So, let's do this. A good trick would be to know where the chains are joined, the link. Once you find that link, you start putting that that spraying. When you get to the link again, you know you're pretty much done 360. I also have one of these, which is a brush, a chain brush, right? So I'm just gonna put it in there like that and let the brush do the work while I rotate the tires. Look at all that extra from actually washing it. Hold it up real good. I'm gonna try to wipe off everything, but um, just a little bit clean and neat. I like to go over it. The whole chain. Oof, cool. Check it out. That's my chain loop. I bought all of these from Amazon. It came as a set. The chain cleaner, the loop, and then the multi-purpose penetration loop. Yeah, you can pretty much use this for anything at all, but um, I like to always put it up that um, I use the chain wax because it keeps um, rust away and moisture and all that kind of stuff.
let it penetrate in there for a minute, right? Once it's in there for a minute, you can go right ahead and just wipe it down. Yeah, I like to wipe it down so when I ride it, I don't get lube everywhere. So here I'm basically applying the VRP product from Chemical Guys. This product is really nice. It makes all the black um, plastics, um, vinyls, anything black on the bike. I like to use this product to go all over it. It keeps it looking really um, new, nice, you know, and there is no shine, like shine to it. It doesn't stain as soon as you apply. Um, the VRP product, it makes everything look really, really nice. You know, all you have to do is put it on an applicator pad like you saw in the um, in the start of this clip and then just wipe it all down and it, your bike comes out looking really nice. I also use it for my cars too, I like it. And that's basically about it guys. I'm the bike is all cleaned up now, looks good. 